and then include it to our newly mounted Google desktop. I'm going to go to zoom.us, go ahead and choose my account, meetings, go ahead and start one of these meetings. Once I start this meeting, people will be joining me. I'm going to choose openzoom.us, connect using my audio, and as you can see, it's automatically recording. I can tell from this button right here. So my, my meeting is being recorded. What I'm saying is being recorded. I'm going to push stop. Once my meeting is over, it's going to tell me it'll be converted when the meeting ends. So I'll choose end meeting and I need to end meeting for all. Then uh, it will say that it's converting the meeting record recording. And then right here is my option to choose a new location where to save it. I'm going to save it to Google Drive. And now that it's mounted, I can add a new folder and I'm going to call it Zoom Recordings. I already have that, so we're going to find it on my folder, but that's how you would add it. There it went. Once that's selected, I choose Choose, um, and then I push Save. And then you can see it's going to save it on my desktop. And then additionally, that way if I go to uh, if I go to my Google Drive, I can also find it in Google Drive, which means that it's not being saved uh, using it's not using my computer storage for the um, for the file size. So that's where we can save our conferencing and how we can do that. If I go to my drive, we can see. Sorry, it's still loading. And right there, Zoom recordings. It does take about three or four minutes for the next one to get up. That one was kind of small, so maybe it was a little bit faster. There's the video I just made.